I feel like Kane Brown and you right now have a connection and you both have that deep register. I feel like if he had like a bunch of string of hits, like 10 number ones. Well, you got set in the night on fire. Yeah, I could see you guys Maybe. doing something. Yeah, like I'd, and, and we wrote that. We wrote that a while back. Um, that's on his deluxe, and he was like, "Hey man, would you come sing on this?" And I was like, "Yeah." I was like, "This actually, you this this one works. That's, that's hard to do a duet with, you know, multiple guys. There's just not that many songs that work for that, but that one does. So I had fun doing that in the studio. Has he told you that he looks up to you? Do you know, like, do you know people that look All up right, to you? So he did an interview, and he he actually said in the interview, and someone played it where he was like, "Yeah, that guy's my hero." And I, I the next time I saw him, I was like, "All right, you get to back off." <laughs> Like that's that's like, too dude. much. That's too much. But he, he, uh, yeah, I mean, he, he, he's he brought just a toothbrush a, for your house. Yeah. Can I just no, keep no, some no. garments in one of the drawers? No, but it's been, it has been cool being out on the road with him and, and just seeing his growth, even from when he and I first got to know each other and started writing when he, you know, I think that was before he was even signed to Sony. I met him through Josh Hogue, um, yeah. who I write with a lot. And he was just like, you got to write with this, this kid. He's awesome.